Hi guys, so it's me Mariah and it's like probably 9, almost close to like 10, 9.55. I just got a text and it just popped up on my phone, so now I know the time. Thank you, my best friend. Anyways, <laughs> um, today we're getting ready. I already did my makeup. I'm not putting lipstick on, just chapstick today because today we are going to be doing, for the first time ever, going to go whitening my teeth. And I never thought about doing this. Honestly, I never did think about doing it. I didn't even know it was a thing, honestly. Like, it sounds weird. But I knew there were strips. And I knew that if you kept brushing your teeth, your teeth would get white. So when I... I just didn't know there was, like, a way to do it where it was, like, bleaching. Because I was like, bleaching? Like, what? what is that? Like, what do you mean? Like, is it, you can't put bleach on your teeth. I didn't understand. I'm, I'm really confident in my smile. I love my smile. Um, I had braces before. And um, I did have a small gap, but my teeth really weren't that bad. Maybe these two teeth, they enter, um, like were tilted a little bit, but that's fine. I never had a problem with my smile or my teeth. I know some people have um, a hard time with their smile or their teeth, and there's no shame of that. You know, everybody wants to um, feel more confident in themselves. So it doesn't matter what you do as long as it fits for yourself. Other than that, um, skipping all that. Meanwhile, um, I need to get ready. So we're going to be getting ready as I talk. Um, cause we have an appointment at 11 and I know I still have an hour, but I'm a girl guys. I, I, I can't even decide on an outfit sometimes. Like that takes an hour and just alone in itself. So we'll see how that goes. Um, other than that, so like I said, we're going to be going to do my teeth whitening for the first time. And there's two different things they offer, which is one is laser. Two is the regular bleaching trays. So we're going to be doing the bleaching trays and the difference between the laser and the bleaching trays is that mostly um, the laser is more of an instant thing. You walk in, you walk out with bright shiny teeth basically. Um, bleaching trays, it's a process. Uh, you, you're taking it day by day, you um, have your tray when they made molds of your teeth and then I guess you put the bleach in it. Um, I'm not really too sure but we're going to learn more together as we go to the dentist appointment because we already made the molds in the beginning process it was just a last minute decision because I really wasn't sure if I was going to do it but they are having a holiday special and they took like I believe it was a hundred off so normally it was 350 and I ended up paying two something and then um for a laser it's about like 500 or 550 I believe it was so um yeah so I decided to do the beach trays because they're a little more cheaper in my price range I'm not trying to spend too much crazy even the laser would have been instant it's fine I'd rather take it slow by slow and I'm good with just the bleach trays. So we're going to go ahead and do that today. And then, yeah. And then we'll go ask Rachel some questions that I have about bleach teeth. And hopefully it would help answer your guys' questions if you're thinking about this. Um, especially, um, I live in the Sacramento area. Well, I live in Roseville. So this place is pretty close. Not too far. Today, I do work today though. Because I work today at 5. And, um... Oh, my hair. I do work today at 5, so at least I have time to relax still. I don't work early like at 2. That would be cutting it close. So yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait to get this bleaching started and my teeth whitening. Um, it's going to be fun. Um, only because it's something that I'm doing for myself and something that I always wanted to do, but I just never really did it. But at least it'll help you guys out there that's um, been wanting to whiten their teeth and then you guys can see. If it's something for you, or maybe the laser's for you. I don't know. If you can't wait and be patient, I would do the laser. <laughs> but I have patience, so I could wait, and I don't mind. Um, but yeah, to go pick those trays up today. And I'll be doing a series vlog on just my um, teeth whitening, which basically we'll just take this thing day by day, and we'll see the progress of my teeth getting white, how my teeth feel afterwards. Basically, you guys just do experience me whitening my teeth I guess um so that's what we're going to be doing um after we start getting this I'll be doing vlog updates about my teeth whitening how it works how it's going so you guys could be in the loop other than that guys that's basically going to be the plan for today so yeah I we're gonna head to the dentistry as soon as I finish this wavy hair to pretty straight um then we'll head to the dentist other than that guys we'll see you in a bit Okay guys, so I'm dressed. This is my outfit for the day. I look at my cute boots from Target. Love them. Um, so yeah, I had to wear a beanie because it is cold. So we are heading to the dentist now. So excited. up to 
to 30 minutes, it'll continue to bleach your teeth. Mm -hmm. um, but like when you stop doing it, do like you have the certain white that you need? Mm -hmm. That's what I mean. Like mm -hmm. do you keep yeah. doing it after a while? You or? keep doing it until you feel like you receive the color you want mm -hmm. and then you can stop. Okay. But then there are always touch-ups that you have to do mm -hmm. when you feel like the color is again wearing off or... And turning yellow? Yeah. Okay, that's what I mean. So it's totally up to you how you feel you've got what you wanted mm -hmm. out of it, and then you can stop. Okay. Are you a coffee drinker? Um, sometimes, yeah. yeah. That's why I have to ask you. Yeah. So you can do it as often as you want until you get the whiteness that you want. Mm -hmm. And then if you just want to maintain, some patients will do it like once a week or once a month. Like everybody's different depending on their eating habits and their staining habits. Mm -hmm. So you well, kind of- the main things that make your teeth yellow that probably should stay away from? Wine, red wine. Oh, I don't drink, so I'm good. <laughs> Uh, if somebody asks me to stop taking coffee, drinking coffee, it's, coffee, it's not gonna coffee happen. One. Coffee's a big one. Mm -hmm. Blueberries. Coffee, tea. Blueberries? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But they're so good for you. Yep. That's weird. I, I so. wouldn't say you stop eating and enjoying what you want to enjoy. Yeah. You can always do the touch ups when yeah. you feel it's going back. <laughs> oh, yeah. okay. If you can always brush after your coffee too. Mm -hmm. So that will help. And mm -hmm. how much um, this compared to the laser, what's the difference? Oh gosh, there's a lot of difference. So with a laser, you're gonna get like instant whiteness, like major noticeable difference instantly. It's mm -hmm. more like instant gratification. Yeah. If you're looking to go for a party or something. Mm -hmm. Like if you want so really, yeah. really white right now, then the laser's the way to but go. But the difference between that, like if I'm comfortable with the white that I see, I could stop, but yeah. that one you just give me whatever kind of white? Um, No, because we kind of actually do it in, in layers so oh, okay. we go over it we see how white it is if you're doing okay we can make it more white oh i see so you go by kind of preference like if you're okay with mm -hmm. it not like super white yeah okay the comparison mm -hmm. okay so you're looking at like 250 for the regular tray system versus 550 with the laser treatment but you also get that hundred dollar discount with the laser so oh okay for holidays that you had it over Yes. Yes. So right now you'll save a hundred bucks if you go with the laser. Mm -hmm. So instead of paying five fifty, you'll pay four fifty, and this like instant whiteness. Okay. So if you start to have sensitivity, that's normal. Mm -hmm. um, you you can just take them out when you start to feel like okay, it's too sensitive for me. If you're tolerating it fine, you can wear it a little bit longer. So. And, but how long do you recommend wearing it for, though? Anywhere between ten to thirty minutes. Ten to thirty. Yeah, and you can do it. And if people well. do it when they're like, what, you just around the house, so that's it. Yeah. Not when you're sleeping, though, because don't, don't do it when you're sleeping. Mm -hmm. I actually fell asleep with trays in my mouth once when I was about your age, and it was it was very sensitive the next day. Oh. Okay. So yeah, it, you get the whiteness that you're looking for, but you will probably be extremely sensitive. Oh, so just be careful, are. yeah. Oh, okay. Because you don't know how your how sensitive your teeth are going to be from it. Okay. Also, um, fluoride toothpaste is really important, so make sure that you are having a fluoride in your toothpaste. Sensodyne is the best one, but it's going to help replace the fluoride that the bleach is going to strip through. That's what I want for to sensitive make sure. For because sensitive I, my teeth get sensitive sometimes. Yeah, so you definitely want to do that. Okay, so I'm going to send you with your bid. If you have any other questions, just call us. Okay. Make sure that you're brushing out your trays after you use them mm -hmm. just with regular wa cold water and a toothbrush okay and that's it and then let them just dry um like air dry okay so we are gks family dentistry we're located in roseville at the corner of east roseville parkway sierra college boulevard um, we are accepting new patients we accept all insurances we are in network with all major ppos as well as medi-cal um, so yeah, give us a call. Our phone number is 916-798-4183. We'd love to have you. Um, and we have a lot of promotions going on right now. So we are giving away free iPad and uh, AirPods. Mm -hmm. um, and we have that bleaching special. So for 150 bucks, you can get your teeth instantly whitened. So hope to see you there. Okay. Thank you. Hi guys. Okay, so now we're back home. Yay from our dentist appointment. Took off my jacket, took off my beanie. You see it right there. Um, so no, I didn't change clothes if some of you guys do think that. Um, they gave me a black bag to put my stuff in. Um, not that the bag is important. So I'm just going to give you guys basically a closer look at everything I got from there so you guys can see it. Um,
So this is my container. It has my name on it and it's my container where they give you to keep your molds in or um, your trays in. So see, those are my both teeth. And basically, so this is my upper teeth. As you guys can see, I took them out. And then these are syringes. Um, there's not a real needle, it's just plastic. Um, and this has the bleach in it and basically so basically what they want us to do is um, let my camera focus for a bit is get this and you pour some in each of these um, and let it drop and sit for a while and then you pop it in and the most she said is 20 to 30 minutes I'll probably do 20 just for my first go around and then slightly move to 30 maybe um, just because this is my first time doing this um, it's not as hard as I thought it was going to be, um, it's just the fact of you doing it and what you means by that is staying consistent with it, you know, because sometimes I have a hard time of staying consistent with things, um, like, because I'm so busy so I had to make time for this, which it shouldn't be that hard, so I'm pretty sure I can do this because I really want to get these teeth white, um, and have a pearly white smile, but yeah. It was uh, JKS Family Dentistry, and I love that place. I had some bad experience with dentists, and they are just so welcoming and warm. I love their office. It's so cute. It's clean. I just love everybody there. They're very informative. They explain things to you. They take time um, to answer your questions, and if you have any more questions, you're more than welcome to call them. If you miss their if you miss them, they give you a call right away back. They're just very commutative, and they stay in touch with you. I just love the environment there. I highly recommend if you guys live anywhere near the Sacramento area, please go to this place and you experience for yourself. There are very wonderful people there, especially Rachel. I appreciate her so very much because she's helped me through this whole process of every time I, since I've been going there since the first time for my first teeth cleaning. And I have just, they just impressed me so much. Also, by the way, they gave me five of these. And if you run out, you could go back and then, um, you know, get more. So that's the good thing. Um, these things also, what I forgot to mention, was it has a cap on it, so don't worry about your stuff drying out when they give it to you. I don't know if all dentist places do this, but um, this is my first time doing it, so I'm, this is my experience. So you just point it out of the hole right here. So then you just take it out right here, and then the cap you still have, which is super tiny, by the way, which I hope I don't lose. And then you plug it back in, and that's it. So that's basically it, though. It's a simple process. Like I said, it's just me making sure I do it every day and being consistent with it and not being lazy and be like, no, I'm not going to do it today, but I can do it. I know I can. This is something I paid for and it's going to be a great result at the end of it. So I'm going to put this back in the bag for now because I don't want to lose them. And then like, you know, because from my luck I lose everything. But other than that guys, like I said, that's basically it for today's video. I'm super happy and excited that we get to start this and I can't wait to see the result. Other than that, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button down below and hit that subscribe button while you're at it. And other than that, I'll see you all next time. Bye!